All right, welcome back everybody to another episode of City Skylines. It's been a while since I've recorded this game. I've had so many issues with it. Uh, past couple days, mainly I've just been removing all the mods and slowly introducing them into the city uh, that I was playing my personal city and uh, just kind of playing that and kind of hoping that, you know, it fixed everything. Pretty much I fixed the issue as it stands with um, game crashing during saves. Uh, but now I start, uh, I still get uh, random memory error um, for some odd reason. It seems to be about 30 minutes to about an hour of playing. I get this really random just memory error. And uh, it's not like it's using a bunch of RAM. Uh, you know, I keep an eye on it and whatnot, but it's, it's not using a huge amount. So um, basically, these episodes are going to be a little bit shorter from here on out. They're going to be like 10 minutes, 15 max. So that way I can. Go ahead and you know save the game, reboot, and try again. You know and create the next episode. It's unfortunate what I'm at to do, but this game, it just overnight the stability just dropped. Uh, I'm I'm not kidding you. Like from one day it was kind of you know it was running good. You know it have the occasional crash of course. You know a mod just wouldn't be happy or something. But then all of a sudden I couldn't save. I couldn't play more than five minutes. I couldn't load cities. I was just having problems but I've disabled a lot of mods uh, you're gonna see I still have you know these these are all mods that I've kind of slowly introduced back into my cities and so I'm hoping that uh, this will this will last us um, at least 10 minutes and hopefully I can save it and reboot it that that's kind of what I'm going for now so things may look a little bit different because I actually did a lot of this off screen uh, I actually did it on screen but then when you know some crash or something and then also did this off camera just to try and see if it was anything with the city you know I change something kind of play around a little bit you know build something and then try and save it or whatnot it took forever to build this interchange it took way too long I had to redo it so many times because I would do something say boom crash finally get through that you know after like three times go do something else boom crash you know three four times finally get that going and then save and boom crash you know it it, it, it took me way too long to make this uh, this interchange but I did learn a lot in the process so I guess I was good I like learned how to make the slopes nice like they're not perfect as you can see uh, but I definitely learned how to make them a lot better than I originally was in the in some of the videos so um, so we completed this interchange. Uh, this this is pretty much how this highway is going to be for now. Uh, I just kind of wanted to focus on getting this interchange just done. That that was the main thing, and we we got that going. So now we can kind of focus on the highway later as we build more down this way. Um, but for now, it's going to stay like this. Um, and then I also brought this into here. Let's see here. This is supposed to connect up in here. Yeah. Let's see, this is just a bunch of stuff that was needing to be done, or has already been done, I should say. And now it needs to be redone because the game is just not happy with me anymore. Um, I will say the performance is a lot better too. I, it was definitely not running at its best like it normally does. I was getting a lot of frame rate issues and whatnot uh, there for a little while. So I, I know they, they did a little bit of a patch uh, earlier. I didn't really read any notes on it, but I, I did come home from work and I seen that there was an update to it. Um, so that may have helped out as well, um, but just who knows? Oh, we need to get an on ramp here. Yeah, I mean, look, I mean, this is the kind of stuff that's happening because it's like, you know, it, you know, there's certain things I'm able to complete, and then there's certain things I do, and then it crashes, and I come back in, and I just completely forget about it, you know, because yeah, I've already done it like four times, and you know, I'm expecting that, you know, hey, I, I did it. <laughs> All right. Uh, there we go. Go to there. That looks pretty good. That gives a little bit of room. All right. So we'll stick with that. So yeah, I've got the dark road textures, um, and the American road textures. So hopefully those will do good. I know I was having a problem with the the American road textures there for a little bit. So hopefully they're not the issue. Uh, but we'll find out shortly. Um, I do want to dig this underground, but that's gonna be an episode on its own. And then we also need to focus on doing this interchange here. It's kind of got me nervous doing this episode because I'm just, if it crashes, then this episode is for nushing. N nushing. Nushing, yes. Uh, that was done for nothing, so hopefully we'll be good. I don't know if we did this on camera. We built a little area for oil, I believe. Um, oh, I like forgot how to play this game all of a sudden. Yeah, oil. Um, so that's that's new. Uh, we do need to get traffic sorted out in this area. Wow, I did not realize how bad that was. 
and it looks like it's a main cause of the train. So, do we want the train to go over or under? I think we'll go over for now, and then we may come under later on. Um, so we'll do... Mm, there we go. Uh, that doesn't come straight across, does it? No. Okay, so we're going to have to have the right tool and just kind of slightly. What? Oh, wrong tool. Just kind of slightly bring it over like that, and then we'll just kind of make it straight. Let's see if we have get a little bit of distance between the pillars just in case we need to widen out that road. It won't be too much of a problem later on. Yeah, it doesn't look very good right now, but I'm going to go and just leave it. That's just going to be kind of a, a patch project for the moment. Um, someone was leaving a suggestion to space out the garbage. Uh, that was definitely a good suggestion. Um, I'm going to go ahead and keep it over here just for the moment, but as we build down, I'm definitely we're going to have to find somewhere else to put some garbage. Um, for some reason, I usually end up with one spot, and that's kind of where I stick everything. And I know that's that's definitely not the way to do it if you want things to be efficient, but I don't know. I just kind of forget about it. Um, but I will work on that, and thank you for leaving that comment. Um, so I'm just trying to think of what I want to do here. So we got this rail. We got this rail. Okay, so we're getting just we're just getting things underway. I'm just kind of get you guys updated. Um, I do know that some of these roads probably could use widen out. Is that or is that not correct? Let's go ahead and take a look here. That intersection, that road's a little, a little heavy on the traffic side. That road is too. So I guess we can take this road down to here and then take this all the way through to here. Have a couple major projects going on through here. That'll work. Um, I think I want to use. I think I want to. Oh, actually, no. Do I? I was thinking of using this guy, but it doesn't create traffic lights, which is good and bad. I, I suppose we can do that. And then hopefully we can uh, work on that. These are these are pretty nice roads. Like I've said a couple times now, I'm excited for when they get a uh, American mod release. So we'll go one past there, and then we'll come down this road. Yeah, that sounds good. Actually no, let's let's do this and this, all right. But then from here on out, so from there so to here, we'll go ahead and do these guys, and we'll have to turn off some traffic lights and whatnot. All right, so that should work, and then that should automatically turn on traffic light there. Yeah, normally it doesn't. Uh, those roads don't have traffic lights. I don't know if that's intended or not. Uh, I like it and don't like it at the same time, so. Alright, so we'll go and do that. Turn that off. Turn that one off. That off. And just go down the line here. Turn all these. Did that one? That one was already off. And there should be traffic lights there. And then hopefully there's none there. Okay. It's really weird not having my zoom in mod because normally I'm used to just zooming in all the way and being able to uh, go into first person, but. That's one of the many things that I've turned off so far. So, yeah, it's going to be a little rough, uh, to be honest with you, to kind of cope with everything. But uh, hopefully mods and uh, Paradox will get everything all figured out before uh, for too long, uh, before the new, uh, uh, the new expansion comes out, which I believe is free, uh, which is pretty cool. Uh, we got an error, so I better save it now. Yeah, we got a few errors. Ooh, when I try to save, oh, I'm just getting pop up after pop up. Yeah, see, I think this is because I disabled some asset that's in this city here. So we're gonna see some rebuilding and whatnot. Um, pause. All right, I need to figure out what that is. I think we're running out of power. Yeah, we're definitely running out of power, so we need to get that figured out. All right, so let's go ahead. Let's see here. We got the most right here. So let's go and put the rest right here. Maybe put, no, we'll stick to just one. Oof, 
Yeah, something uh, something is definitely not happy with us. Um, all right, so I think we, we nope, we're still getting that error. So I'm gonna have to go through and figure out which uh, which thing I turned off. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. It was something I turned off in that city broke it, this city. Uh, we don't have power at all over here. What did I break? See, I can't even tell what I've done anymore because the game just. I mean, it was literally unplayable for the longest amount of time there. Alright, so we got power all the way up and through here we are. Wait, what? Hmm. What's the big deal over here? Is this another bug or what? Um, we're just not getting power over here. What is this about? We got more than enough, but that grid is just dead. We got one power line here that's on. What is this about here? Do we just need to run new power lines or what? You know, I have a feeling the game's going to crash. So I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here. It's been about 10 minutes. And I'm going to go and see if I can figure out the air as well as uh, things going on um, with the uh, power situation here. See so if I can get that figured out real quick. Um, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Hopefully things will get a little bit better. As always, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.